now and I've also been watching your movies for some time now as well. And one of my favorite ones is Good Kids and it's the one we're going to speak about today. Uh, one of the first questions I'm going to ask you is, how did you come up with the idea for the script? Well, we've been doing films for quite a while now and when I say we, I'm talking about me and my friend Marty. Uh, but we did uh, silly stuff mostly when we were younger, 14, 15. But we always wanted to do something a little bit more serious, uh, grittier, so to speak. And with this project, we were given the opportunity to embark on this darker journey. And we just grabbed it and did our best, since we had never done something like this. Uh, did you write the script on your own? Yes. How long did it take? Uh, well, we came up with the concept one, uh, one afternoon. Uh, and uh, when I went home at night, I wrote the whole thing. Uh, but then, of course, I had to, ca uh, to come back and rearrange it, improve it, you know, uh, change it up a little bit. So it took probably about a week. Good Kids approaches a lot of things, uh, but um, what, if you had to choose, what would you say is the main theme of the movie? I would say it's family, uh, mostly because it's what drives my character to do whatever it is he, that he does. Uh, of course, there are more themes uh, subtly included in the film, but I would say that family is probably the biggest one. One of the questions many people asked throughout the project was, why 30 minutes? Well, it was 30 minutes because it couldn't be any longer. Uh, it had to be a short film, but of course when you're doing a piece like this, you want it to be something uh, character-driven. You want people to empathize, the audience to empathize with the characters. And since the characters are doing bad stuff that people wouldn't normally approve of, you want to make them believable, you want to humanize the characters. and. In order to humanize them, you need to have them on screen a lot of time. Since it was a short movie, we couldn't do much. But if I had the chance of doing it again, I would probably do it longer. Of course, not in a project like this, because it's limited to short film. Uh, I guess the only question that remains now is, are you going to do any more movies after this? Uh, yes, uh, we're currently working on a new project called Streets, and I hope to have it all wrapped up by 2015. Uh, thank you for being here. Thank you for interviewing.